Okay, so I'm currently packing for my trip and I thought, why not pack with me? So I'm gonna show you some of the bits as I try them on. Keep in mind, I've not ironed or steamed any of these. I'm just hoping the hotel will have an iron. Um, but this dress arrived the other day and it's so doofy day. I really hope that's my parcel. Um, yeah, it arrived the other day and it's so beautiful. So I'm actually going away for a wedding and I panic bought loads of dresses. I think I ordered about six dresses and none of them have arrived. So this might be a potential save the day wedding dress because I mean, I feel like it's classic, it's beautiful and I love it. Um, and then this is the back detailing. Can't really do it up properly. Um, and then I thought, for like a casual day look, I would just wear it with like a little Bottega, Bottega style bag. And then my Louis on sandals, which I really need a bloody clean, so I'm not gonna show you up close. Um, but I thought it'd make a cute little day or even even like a casual evening look as well so i'll take the sandals but i will also take a pair of heels that i could wear with this potentially in case i do need it for the wedding but yeah i thought this was just beautiful okay a few things please ignore the fact that it's peeing it down outside so if you can hear the rain ever so sorry about that and it's so dark um, and then three, I've not done this dress up just because I can't be bothered. Um, so just imagine it fits a bit nicer. But if this, I don't know if this is too short for a wedding. Like, is this too short? It's a black tie wedding. So if this dress was longer, I feel like this would literally be perfect. But I don't know if it's too short. Um, but how beautiful is this detailing honestly this dress is absolutely everything and i cannot wait to wear it um and i thought it it would look great with my new prada silver shoes like how good do those colors go only thing is i don't really have a bag i really need like a little silver clutch um but i'm obsessed i love this dress I just wish it was a maxi and then I feel like if it was a maxi it would be perfect for the wedding um but I do feel like I've got a lot more options than I thought so this and then we also have this dress which is so beautiful obviously I wouldn't wear this for the wedding part of the trip so before I go to Montenegro I'm actually going to Belgrade so I'll probably wear that there because obviously it is quite wedding-y um but it just fits beautifully and i don't normally like like girly girly dresses like this but i feel like this is so cute it's not really short shoes maybe some nude ones okay guys i feel like i'm doing a lot better than i thought i hadn't really shopped for this trip purely because i was so unorganized and it came around so quick and obviously we're at the well we're in September now, so I don't really want to buy a load of new summer stuff. But I feel like I'm doing good. Like, how beautiful is this dress? This is the most perfect blue, even though the lighting's so bad, so you probably won't be able to tell. It's got this lovely silver ring deck detailing here. And then it's backless. Again, this would look great with hills or flats. So this is a definite, this is definitely coming with me. Really, really enjoying this one. Okay, this is nothing like groundbreaking, but it's just like a super easy silk black shirt dress. And it's got this like beautiful detailing. Don't know if it looks a bit like a robe, <laughs> but I thought this might be easy just to pack and wear on one of those nights where i just feel a bit like oh 
because it's just easy and nice. And then I could always jazz it up with a pair of stunning shoes. Um, or I could even wear it in the day. So maybe I will pack this as well, actually, because this is a great like, day or night option. And it's just super easy and so comfortable. Like I feel comfortable in it. I can eat all the pizza, all the carbs in this because there's plenty of room. Okay, I really, really hope the Pokemon doesn't knock right now because he has seen me in some questionable outfits. But I completely forgot about this and ignore the fact I've not done it up properly. It will reach, I think. Um, but this for a black tie wedding does feel a bit extra but where else am i ever gonna wear this to and it's so beautiful the only thing is it's gonna be a bit of a nightmare to pack um yeah this could be the one maybe with like my black diamante heels and a little black bag that i don't own but i'll figure that out near the time but could this be the one also i feel like this has actually turned into a pick my wedding guest outfit with me <laughs> okay so what was meant to be a come pack with me <laughs> video has now taken a turn um so half this video is going to be a mini haul of what i packed and then the second half, this half, is going to be a haul of some bits I've just got in. Um, but they're not really holiday vibes, they're actually like autumn pieces. And there's some really good bits. But the reason I'm filming this is because I was meant to go on holiday yesterday. But obviously I didn't. <laughs> but I explained that in the vlog, so I'll link that vlog down below. Um, and then today I had some pieces arrive and I didn't want to waste this video because the stuff i did pack for my trip which i still think i'm going on the second part of my trip um so I still will take i like really good pieces but i went out drunk a lot of wine with my friends and didn't finish the rest of the video so here i am i'm gonna show you some new in bits um so i'll show you what i've got on i've got some really good coats and I feel like it's, I feel like coat weather hasn't even really started and the addiction has already started. So I'll just quickly show you these nylon running shorts because I think they're so cute. My black parachute trousers that I always wear, that short version. And I love a runner short. I just think they're so easy to style. And then I've just got like a basic grey tee on, which is nasty girl. And then this striped duster coat which I'm in love with. It does need a bit of a steam, so please ignore that. But if I just step back, it's like super long. I did size up, I think two sizes. Um, yeah, so I've got a size 10, just so it's super oversized, super like baggy. It gives me like men vibes, but I really, really enjoy it. So this is coat number one. Okay, coat number two is this beautiful khaki puffer jacket. And this does also come in black, but I thought this was so cool for like the colder seasons. Um, I do feel like I need a dog because I feel like this is the perfect dog walking jacket. Um, but so if we just tie it up for you, you can also tie it up it's honestly so snuggly and warm and i just think it looks super cool like this with some leggings for like a nice little stroll when it's cold with a hot chocolate i feel like i'm so ready for that now <laughs> got one holiday to get out of the way and then i'm ready okay and then we just have one more coat and it's this beautiful yellow one Yellow is not really a colour I normally reach for, but I feel like this colour palette for autumn is so beautiful. And the jacket, let me just move back, is perfect. Like, so 
freaking nice and so cool. I got this in the size 8. So it's already a bit oversized. So I wouldn't suggest sizing up. Um, but yeah, I love this. Just teamed it with my far, by far bag. This little white tank, which is so cute. I will also link that. And then these jeans are also new in. I needed dark, a pair of dark denim. And I did order a pair from Good American, but they were too big. And by the time I went back to get my true size, they were sold out. Then I found these, and these fit so nicely. Um, so yeah, finally found a pair of dark denim that works for me. Guys, look how beautiful this skirt is. I don't even know if it's going to come across on camera how beautiful it is but i feel like this is the perfect mini skirt if you enjoy mini skirts for the party season like the colors are insane like i love this and i'm not really a sequin kind of gal so i've paired it with my prada platforms and then again my bar by far bag and just like a basic white tee but this would also look great with a white shirt but I need to go dancing immediately. But how nice. This is my new favorite skirt. Okay, then we have a pair of shoes. I thought I'd just show you like this because it's a bit hard to show you on. Um, they are so soft, but cowboy boots are very in season. And I thought these ones were lovely. They look so expensive as well. I love the shade they're in. I love the fact they're suede and they're so soft. And I mean, look at the detailing. Okay, and then moving on to tops. Ignore the hair. It's just going to be chaotic trying these on. Um, but how beautiful is this sweater? I loved the detailing. And I'm obsessed with this green colour and the high neck. I've just paired it with a low-rise jeans. But obviously, I know that's not for everyone. I feel like this would also be great with some, like, suit trousers. And it's just like a great knitwear to have for this season. Like, look at this colour. Okay, then we have this one, which is obviously a little bit dressier. But I need is like a dressy black top for, I say nights out. I don't really go on nights out. <laughs> but, like, but like evening events or like dinner dates, etc. And I thought this one was so beautiful. This would also look great on holiday. Um, but I would pair this with like a pair of high-waisted tailored black trousers and heels and I just feel like it's the perfect like going out top but then also if you're on holiday this would look great with like a black maxi slip skirt that's what I've got in mind anyway so yeah I thought this was super cute it's also so soft okay I think this might be my favorite one this is literally the softest thing I have ever put on. I just love the colours. I love the high neck. You probably can't tell, but it has actually got like little shoulder pads here. And I just feel like this is such a good knit for the colder season. Like, I'm obsessed. This is so nice. Okay, and then I'm just going to end, end this haul pack of me video. <laughs> with this sweater as I'm actually just going to stay in this outfit for the day because it's so cosy and I'm just running the errands um, I got this in a large, probably just like need large um, it is very cosy though and I do quite like the fact it's like a dress um, but I love these just to chuck over my gym kits when I'm going to the gym and I thought the graphic was super cool it gives me that, that vintage feel um, but yeah, just for reference, this is what a large looks like. Like a medium would have been fine. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and enjoyed some of the items I showed you. And as always, please like, comment and subscribe if you did enjoy this video. And I'll see you in the next one.